Well, February is Black History Month and Governor Tim Walz began it by signing the Juneteenth bill into law. The bill establishes June 19th, also known as Juneteenth, as a official state holiday. On that date in 1865, the abolition of slavery was complete when the last remaining slaves in the United States were emancipated in Texas. Some Minnesota school districts and businesses have already been celebrating Juneteenth, but now the state government will as well, conducting no business on that day. The bill had bipartisan support and passed through the House yesterday in a lopsided 126 to 1 vote. The governor was passionate about the greater importance of the bill at today's signing. An act relating to state government. Many times barriers are put in place and misunderstanding of one another because we're not doing our part in educating and telling the history. And this will be a day of celebration. It'll be a day of a state holiday, but it'll be a day of educating folks why this is important, why folks worked hard at this. Black Americans and black Minnesotans need their history told, and our students can deal with this. They understand. They want to be critical thinkers on what this country and the greatness of what we can do in this country when we acknowledge these types of events and these types of holidays. The U.S. government made Juneteenth a federal holiday in 2021. Minnesota is now the 26th state to officially recognize it as a holiday. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.